The most common concern that's voiced in our office for lip filler is people's concern to look overdone or ducky. And usually the reason they come to us is because they've read our reviews or seen our brand and that we provide natural results. So in this video, I'm gonna go over how we do that and what you can look for to tell if you might be at risk for looking ducky with lip filler. So the first thing to look at is how much teeth show when you open your mouth. So the distance, between the nose and the mouth here, that's the filtrum column. And when the filtrum column is long, people are automatically at more risk to look ducky. So open your mouth a little bit, and do you see any teeth? And if you can see a little bit of teeth, that's a good sign that you're less likely to look ducky. If you don't see any teeth, or in general, when you look at your proportions and this distance is quite long, then one, you'll need to see a very experienced injector that knows how to handle this so that they don't overfill you, or you may consider seeing a plastic surgeon for a consultation for what's called a lip lift. Now, a lip lift is different from a lip flip in that a lip lift is surgical and it's where they shorten the distance between the lip and the nose. A lip flip is used with botulinum toxin injections and that just kind of helps barely shorten the distance or flip up the lip a little bit. It works for some people, doesn't work for others. But that's why it's important to see an experienced injector. Because the second reason that people will look ducky or overdone is because of their injector. And that's either because the injector listened to the patient when the patient said they wanted, you know, three syringes of lip filler, and they didn't think if that would be a healthy thing to do for them or not, or the injector maybe just doesn't have an artistic eye. They're injecting everybody the exact same way. And you can't really do that. You have to respect people's individual anatomy, how much lip filler they can fit in their lips and things like that. So first you're gonna check for the distance in the lip, and then two, you're gonna find a really experienced injector that's going to give you a natural result and you should be able to avoid having ducky or overfilled lips. 